Tesla 4680 battery will be the end of solid state battery according to Elon Musk. And so when we put it all together and go to our new 80 millimeter length, 4680 we call this uh, new cell design, for the past few years, Elon Musk has amazed the world with his futuristic vision and projects. Musk is a visionary who has reshaped the way we're looking at technology and caused optimism about the future. But there's one hurdle that he has yet to overcome. It's batteries. They're the only complication refraining Musk from raising Tesla vehicles to the next level. He recently disclosed that Tesla is working on a revolutionary 4680 battery, which is going to revolutionize the entire EV industry. Lithium-ion batteries were first proposed by British chemists in 1970. These batteries power most of the consumer electronics in today's society. It wasn't until 1985 that a man named Akira Yoshino created the first working lithium-ion battery prototype. Then in 1999, the first commercially viable lithium-ion battery was developed by the scientists working for Sony. This battery is better than any other type of battery that were used before, as the first rechargeable lead-acid batteries that were manufactured in 1859 are 10 times bigger, need 3 times longer charging times, and have 5 times smaller power density than lithium-ion batteries. So it's no surprise when lithium-ion batteries took over the world in an instant. These batteries still have their limitations and are lagging behind virtually every other electronic component today. The reason why our technology is not evolving as fast as it could is batteries. Scientists and engineers are yet to discover a way to store more energy in a smaller space. But Elon Musk has recently unveiled some of the details of the new 4680 battery, which could cause a second battery revolution and totally reform our world as we know it. Since 2013, Tesla has had a Battery Day event every year, where they reveal their latest progress in the Department of Batteries. It's one of the most important days for the Tesla fanboys, as they're aware that batteries are holding back the progress of EVs. This year, Musk revealed Tesla's new 4680 battery and acclaimed it for revolutionary properties. The new 4680 battery will be tabless, meaning that it can reduce the electrical path, thus curtailing resistance and diminishing the heat. Moreover, rejecting the former design containing tabs makes these batteries easier to yield, as now it's essentially a one-piece battery, instead of having multiple tabs, which used to cause manufacturing problems. Cobalt is a great component for batteries, but it's toxic for humans, so the new Tesla battery won't contain cobalt, like the old batteries. It is better to use less dangerous materials in a car, and cobalt was substituted with high nickel cathodes, which resulted in even greater performance. This changes all Tesla to fit more power in less space. Just to explain, let's take an example of Model 3. The long-range battery pack consists of 4,416 2170 battery cells, while the same job could be performed with only 960 new 4680 cells. A car is easier to manufacture when it requires fewer individual parts, hence it becomes cheaper as well. So how will these batteries influence us, the consumers? Firstly, it's going to be six times more powerful than predecessors and hold five times more energy. The new battery is also twice the size of the current 2170, but it's going to be way more efficient and result in more range per battery space. Lastly, due to its tabless structure, its charging time will be incredibly fast. It's estimated that charging the new Tesla Model 3 with a 4680 battery pack from 10 to 80% will take just 15 minutes. The new 4680 battery is not only better in pretty much every way, but it is also anticipated to be 50% cheaper than current batteries. Not only is it simpler to make, but it's also going to utilize 30 to 40% less steel, which is one of the most expensive components in batteries. Finally, 
The new battery is also more environmentally friendly than its predecessors. It requires less water to make and is less harmful to the environment, which results in making Tesla EVs even greener than they already are. It is expected to be used in the new Tesla Model 3, which is expected to be revealed in 2022, and Tesla Semi, which is a new generation truck that has already been delayed for three years and currently is planned to also roll out in 2022. However, it is vital to point out that while the prototypes of Tesla's new battery are working, the entire job is not yet completed. As the Q2 financial report in 2021 has disclosed, we have successfully validated performance and lifetime of our 4680 cells produced by our Cato facility in California. While substantial growth has been made, we still have work ahead of us before we can attain volume production. Internal crash testing of our structural pack architecture with a single piece front casting has been triumphant. We are all aware that Tesla is no stranger to production delays. Nearly every Tesla vehicle has been delayed, and it's infuriating the fans. However, Elon Musk has been working on it for almost a decade, trying to discover ways to speed up the manufacturing process. It's shown by the Gigafactory in Berlin, which was revealed in 2019 and was planned to be opened in the summer of 2021. Unfortunately, it was delayed, and now its launch date is pushed back to the end of 2021. The factory is expected to produce up to 100 gigawatt hours in batteries annually, making sure that Tesla can fulfill the high demand for new models. By 2030, Tesla expects to have several more gigafactories producing their new 4680 batteries and have a battery production of up to 3 terawatt hours per year consolidating their position as the global EV leader. We're yet to see whether Elon Musk will manage to fulfill his promises, but if he does it, it's going to revolutionize the entire electric vehicle industry.